normal waist can. But this, this is not normal. So why did I build that? After observing the bad waste disposal habits and the adverse consequences in Thailand local schools, I wanted to make waste disposal fun for the students. So I got to work developing prototypes, testing hardware components, coding for the integrated circuit, and debugging again and again and again. So this whole integrated circuit is powered by this power bank right here, which also connects in parallel to the breadboard to connect to other components. This Arduino codes for all the hardware components, including the hall sensor right here, which detects the presence of magnets and detects whether the lid is closed or not. The keypad here, which the data is saved into this SD card. And another circuit is basically with the solenoids. So the Arduino sends instructions to the relays, which close or open the switch and the battery to run through to operate the solenoids. And also here. So the solenoids work to open or close the top and the middle lid. And it also, there are also indicator light bulbs here, LEDs, and that's the whole integrated circuit. The steps are simple. The student presses their home room, followed by the waste type. After placing the trash in the bin, the camera takes a picture and stores it in the SD card for farther analysis. The layer then drops down to store the waste. Essentially, a program records the data and awards points to each homeroom for correct classification, encouraging them to be mindful of their disposals and compete with each other to be the best homeroom. After I implemented the product to a local school, I taught the teachers and admin to use the system, integrating it into students' after-school activities and science classes. The students really enjoyed using the waste can, and aside from the points they're earning, they're also earning themselves a healthier environment.